Nacho. Chris, man, how are you, my friend? I'm excellent. A lot of people may not understand that you've been working hard your entire life. Yeah. So, and, and you've been doing a lot of successful things. You've worked with a lot of successful people. So what do you think makes the voice different? Oh, I mean, I, I kind of say I've been working, I've had some really cool jobs, but I've never had a career. So I never had the break. I've, I've come close a couple times. But this is the first time that I've really had a, what I think feels like something bigger than that. So, so how do you feel you did tonight? I, I was really happy with tonight. I wouldn't have changed a thing. I, beautiful song, you know, beautiful staging. I felt really uh, in the moment, which is awesome. And I think Christina liked it too. So good. Tell me, what have you learned from Christina during this entire period? More than I could possibly ever describe. Uh, she just instills such confidence in me, and that is one thing that I always kind of struggled with a little bit. Um, definitely uh, in terms of enjoying the moment and really feeling the song, that's something I've improved on a lot. So I'm really thankful for that. What brings you the most peace in your life right now? <laughs> um, tonight is going to be alcohol. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Not every night, but tonight, yeah, uh, brings me peace. You know, doing songs like that, I would say that this is this is my that was my dream uh, realized. I I don't get very often an opportunity to really sing like a gorgeous classical piece like that, but in a contemporary setting where it's not stuffy like that was cool and that was hip and we were all in it together and that was something that I that's what I'm hoping to do more of and so that that brings me peace. Chris, it, it, let's say you won The Voice, what would be your ultimate dream, I mean musically, if you could do anything? If I could do anything, uh, I would do a concert uh, all over the world on all those European amphitheaters outdoors at Madison Square Garden. I'd make a record and join the likes of Josh Groban and Andrea Bocelli and, and, uh, and the likes. And But do something like I can do Ave Maria, but I could also do Viva La Vida by Coldplay. Make it all one thing. You can have a great time, but you can hear beautiful music at the same time. Would you ever want to jam with Yanni? <laughs> Yanni's pimp, man. I'm not going to count it out. No, I mean, that guy's like <laughs> sipping wine in front of these stages yeah. in Greece that playing oh, yeah. to hundreds of thousands. Of oh, yeah. That sounds pretty good to me. No. <laughs> Chris, man, we wish you much success Thank in your you. career. Have a good night. The Blaring Out Show.